Were you told at a young age that happiness will lead you to success? Well, chances are you've probably gone through this experience of reaching the next goal and the next milestone and the next level. Constantly in this pursuit of this happiness that you were told that you would get as a result of this success. And maybe like me, you may have reached levels of success and not felt happy. What gives? The problem is when we're in this pursuit of success being the means to our happiness, we find that to be a very lonely experience. And oftentimes we're doing everything that we can do to create that success, not really thinking about other people. Well, my experience of what happiness is, it's the gateway to success. And part of that gateway is by taking a different look of what being selfish really means. I'm Thomas Edwards, creator and author of The One Up Effect, helping high-performing professionals who have families have fun becoming their best self through purpose, play, passion, and performance. In this video today, I'm gonna to share with you a very simple but important concept around why being selfish in a different way is the key to not only creating your greatest happiness, but also your greatest success. While it might feel selfish to be in this pursuit of success and happiness, I do believe many people who pursue the success want to be in position so they can help others. Now, while we can see that the intention of wanting to be successful isn't selfish, the journey to getting there may feel, the experience of it might feel selfish and lonely. And so I actually have a different approach to how we can experience happiness and, and let that be the gateway towards our success. And it's just a simple change in how we see selfishness. I personally believe that if we see selfishness with a lowercase s, then yes, we're wrapped up in ourselves, what we can get out of the situation, what's in it for us, how we, can get into a better situation. And while we still may have those intentions to be in a better position to help other people, the journey to getting there doesn't allow us to help other people because we're so focused on ourselves. But I like to believe that people can incorporate a selfishness that has a capital S, where we get to help people along the way to helping ourselves. In fact, I believe that helping others creates more of an impact on ourselves than trying to be in a position where we are successful so we can help other people. I believe that if we take more time to take care of ourselves, then we can be in better position to help other people. But when it comes to success and creating happiness for ourselves, we actually, and studies have shown, that helping other people have created more happiness and more success than us trying to be successful to help other people. So the next time you think about what actually creates success, I want you to think about two things. One is that happiness is the gateway to your success. And the second thing is the gateway to your happiness is actually through helping others. But this is what I think. Comment below, let me know what you think. This idea of helping others to be happy to success, what do you think about that? Were you raised to think that success was gonna be the gateway to your happiness? And have you actually experienced that? And are you open to the idea that maybe it's the other way around, that happiness can be the source of your greatest success? Comment below, let me know about your experience. Please like, subscribe, hit that bell, get notified when we put out videos which happen almost every single day. And if you found this video interesting or inspiring, please share this with someone who might find this interesting or inspiring too. I'd love to hear what they have to say and get them in on the conversation. If you wanna learn the exact process and science behind reducing stress, eliminating burnout, and having fun improving areas of your life, including your health, wealth, self, marriage, family, career, business, and not feel the need to sacrifice personal happiness or professional ambition, you can go to thomasedwardsjr.com. Once again, this is Thomas Edwards reminding you to make life a game that you can win and have fun playing. Until next time, I'll see you around.